私の笑顔を大事にしてくださいねカッカ Hey everyone, this is Nitro. In this video, I am going to be covering Florentia's five gates of fate. So let's get started and hopefully get them all cleared. So my Florentia is going to be a mere three stars. She has two out of four class mastery in her tactician class. I'm going down this line first because I want her to end up in her mage class, Imperial Chancellor. So, going up the other line first, then eventually I'll unlock those other two classes to get her fully upgraded. So, other than that, her gear is temporarily taken from Rachel. Um, it has her set up with 285 in plus 275. So, let's just jump into her bond page, get a few more things unlocked on her before I start because for example, I have to um, upgrade her bonds a bit and so on. So there's various tasks I have to do to get her uh, fully usable. Oops, I think I just used one of the items I normally sell. That was kind of careless, but whatever. So I'm just throwing it. some intimacy items into her. So that I can actually get access to her Gate of Fate battles. Right. So that's level Almost there. There we go. Good enough. All right, so what's next? Let's take a look at her bonds as well. So I have to use her in arena five times, uh, upgrade into one class, and then her fourth bond requires Tsubame's help, which I don't have. And then her final bond requires Licorice's help, which I do have. So all right, let's upgrade her basic bond at least up to max as well. This is so annoying that I have to wait between each effect. I hope this is one of the things that as long as we'll fix up soon enough. Alright, so there we go. So I'll keep in mind I have to do 5 arena battles with her. But other than that, the other bond should be unlocked eventually. Except for this one. Complete a twist in the tail with Tsubame's help. Alright, let's go into the gates of fate though. So, predestination, you just have to survive 5 rounds. Tsubame is not defeated and send no more than one hero into battle. So, in other words, you can only send Florentia. Let's see what the storyline is here. Hmm. Leisurely lifestyle afforded by peace. Family problem. All right, so it's just Florentia with Tsubame here, and you just have to survive five turns. 
and you defeat it if Betty or Narm reach the designated location. So you have to prevent Betty or Narm from getting to the center here. Alright, and finally, let's take a look. Is there any reason to bring melee characters? I don't think there is. So instead, let's just switch to the Sky Archers. Alright, let's begin. You can also double check the feats one more time, right? Send one hero, and you can't lose Tsubame. Let's see. Snare can reduce enemy mobility by one. So maybe I'll just start moving her over here. And guess I'll just do a nice attack. No. Oh. And she gets a stratagem. Consumed one battle strategy to restore hit points and so on. Let's just increase the mobility. Who are you, two noisy women? <laughs> Lance is cheating with all these girls. This family. Huh. They couldn't come up with any better names. Alright, let's just try this. So if I attack her, what really happens? She gets stunned. Okay. And over here, let's. Like Betty. I think both end up stunned this way. Oh no, I didn't get stunned. So, Sorrentia keeps an arm stunned. And... Subame keeps Betty stunned. And that's it. Well, just in case, you might as well. Stun an arm one more time. And since she can't reach this tile, I can just move out of the way. The 
this is a family dispute. <laughs> Puppy dog pitiful expression. Dare leave. Chose the wrong person. Lens. It's a bloodbath. A total bloodbath. Interesting. <laughs> Eat Lady Florent, just gross food. I guess it's a reference to the original game that I never played. So is she gonna end her grudge or is she going to actually act on it? The next battle is called Assassination, so she might be acting on it. Emergency, Claret is in danger. So in alternate worlds, she'll take revenge on innocent people. Let's see, win within four rounds, no one on your team was killed. Let's go. Troublesome people. Wrong. 
strongest of heroes. Assassinating these people? They mentioned an invasion of Kalsaf. <laughs> Does that mean Kalsaf invaded them instead? Mm, whatever. Take her down. Defeat all enemies. And no one from the team was killed. I actually don't know what I'm doing here, but let's just deploy Lena and see. Or maybe Shafinio. I don't think it really matters. Hero saves the princess style of confession. Interfering in the affairs of others. Sanctioned them all down. Ding ding ding. Today's performance of the Confession of Alfred, the Princess Savior, is over. Now I would like to declare that Claret's birthday party has officially commenced. We accidentally did that in a birthday party. Why does throwing a party get them funds? <laughs> Total Yandere here. Don't come any closer to my master! So, from an assassination plan to a birthday party?
Hmm. Oh crap. <laughs> we need to rounds, no one on your team was killed. Third battle. Despite the suffering, despite suffering these setbacks, my plan for Kalsaf must continue. Use Subame to attack Lance within the first turn. Win within two turns. All right. Hmm. Sending fake letters again. Okay. Tears betrayed us on the way. so bad that people faint. <laughs> I'm a rock, they can't see me? Bami has to attack Lance and then win within two turns. Is there any other abilities? Nope, that's it. So, well, I don't deploy anyone, so let's just begin and see. How can I get her enough mobility to attack Lance though? Not sure I understand. So I'm looking at this and I don't see any ability that could allow me to do that. Well, let's see. Maybe I'll just mass attack. I give her enough mobility? Oh wait, actually does. Okay, there we go. So Subame. Strike lands. And then I can have Sh 
Shuri. Strike arm, I guess. Alright, so far so good. So now I just need to win this battle this turn. So maybe I'll have her strategic regroup skill. And then turn. And Shuri can just take down Norm, act again, and I guess kill off Lance. Bravest one. The ridiculous class skipping affair. Loaded cards. Getting involved with family drama is totally not doing what she's talking about. Alright, there it is. So I can do these last two battles because I have some extra gate of fate runs. So let's continue. So a twist in the tail on one some on a sunny day at a golden beach, Florentia meets the legendary tactician. So I just want to go back quickly and just double check. Is this this is the battle where you use Subame if you have her? Unfortunately, I don't. Right? I only drew for one of the two heroes in the banner, you know. And as much as I would like to get Florentia, I just don't. Or I would as much as I would like to get Subame, I just think it's not that likely I'll get her. And then I'm far more likely to get a duplicate Florentia. Which, now that I think about it, may not necessarily be a bad thing, but um, we'll see. At the very least, there's no rush for me to get this Tsubame duplicate yet. So let's just continue. Well, if I do rush and I get her, then I can first unlock her fourth bond. And yeah, I don't know. And I would never have to do the state of fate ever again. But if I don't get her today, then I would have to come back to do the state of fate one more time in the future. You know what? I think it's okay. Let's just clear it. So catch all the rock lobsters within two turns and no one from the team was killed. <laughs> the glutton.
Oh, and she's in her swimsuit. Delicious plump food. So normally you would end up with two Subames and Florentia and Luna and you have to kill off eight rock lobsters I guess but that's not what I have so I'll just deploy Lana yet again and AOE them down. Rather than assassinating Luna, it turns into a battle to make food. suddenly turns into a battle against Luna? Interesting. Didn't expect that. So they do it after all. Alright. Oh, in any case, let's just finish off Luna then. friends.
right. Hmm. Puzzle. <laughs> she suggested Bozel turn Valzeria into an amusement park. Rock lobster breeding business. Prepared for Miss Maya. And suddenly Florentia is okay with that. So weird. Alright, there we go though. Fourth battle cleared. The fifth one requires licorice. Let's see. There is nothing in this world that cannot be solved by a meal. If there is, it can probably be solved by two meals. <laughs> Okay, win the battle from six turns, send no more than one hero into battle. Ah, so that forces this up to be cleared twice, no matter what. Because one battle you'll clear with Licorice, the other battle you'll clear with Florentia. Oh. Okay, well, let's get started. Licorice first. Here we go. That more lemon juice. Yes, she's gonna finish everything by poisoning them all. Chris first. And I don't think there's anything left to do. Let's begin. At most sincerity. this effect food has been caught <laughs> guess I'll have a quick step and attack this one They run away! Or they seem to randomly move. Accelerated rot. 
Oh, whatever. Kill us and catch it. Guess I might as well try this. Mass attack herself. This battle is annoyingly long, I suppose. She's so far away from Getter, she can't buff anyone. Shows up too. Huh. So maybe killing this guy last is the best because she applies rotten mark to enemy units. Oh, if any characters go rotten, you lose. Okay, so now you want to kill him. Just going to have Luna. Spin God Realm towards the Northern Because that one that's rotting is going to be an issue. Storinja, so, come over this one. And finally, Licorice can toss up the Dark Despair to wipe out the last two that are really damaged. What? They went rotten! Or it says they went rotten. Why? Okay, that's weird. I'm not sure I understand why, but I guess I have to kill them with single target strikes. AoEs are not allowed. Interesting. That's weird. Okay. So AoEs are not allowed. You have to kill them with single target strikes. But there we go. for the Kalsa family to get poisoned. Hmm. Seems nobody who's smart can deal with Shuri. 
right? Keith, Florentia, and so on and so forth. Rather strange. This pumpkin fishy smell. <laughs> Mysterious food our meta always tells us that, says hor that smells horrible but has a sweet aftertaste. No, <laughs> it's just bad. <laughs> KO! and Lum have both lost consciousness. Your plan has succeeded. <laughs> the secret weapon destroyed the enemy. So there we go. I'll get this other feet afterwards and then I will be done. Alright, so now I'm going to clear Florentia's fifth gate of fate with Florentia only, where I send one hero into battle and that's it. So here we go. This time around I'm going to skip the storyline. And then it's just Florentia and let's begin. Here we go. Turn, Turn on danger zone. Um, let's start with Subami crushing a lobster in the south. And Florentia crushing the cuttlefish. Can't rush anyone, so she's just gonna enter. Actually, she could rush herself to make sure she can take out this guy next turn. Fortunately, I activated Breeze though, so I'm able to crush this rare ingredient anyways. Let's try using Rush on myself this time around, maybe? But I currently still have 5 movement, so I, there's no point. Who has the Accelerated Rot? Oh boy, the Cuttlefish in the far north does. So maybe I'm going to use Shadow Steel to go towards whoever got accelerated rot that first turn. This. Just have to kill that one fast. So turn three, Luna spawns. So if I have her, quick step here. I can get rid of that last cuttlefish. That has accelerated rot. And then the rest of this is just wiping out the remaining characters. Mm. 
might as well rush yourself this time around. So that way I have 5 mobility. And then Luna. I'm pretty sure Luna should be able to kill off a character with Raging Thunder, even without using Wind God Realm. Leaves three. So, one down. Might as well wind spiral here. Two down. Just put them off the third and be done with it. And there we go. So there we are. Um, All her gates of fate cleared with all the feats retrieved. Now, actually, I ended up drawing for Tsubame, so I can do her twist of a tail to unlock her fourth bond. So I'm going to try that. So what I've done with my party for this specific fight is I have given my Tsubame Zeradis gear. So I'm just trying to find where she is right now. Uh, she got moved up. There we go. So right now, all I have for her is her very, very basic class. Her starting class has the mastery. At least I got backstab unlocked. And in terms of soldiers, I ha currently have catapults on her and she's running the extreme magic bow Sarah to set. So let's see how this goes. Trying to find Florentia again. There she is. Let's go into her Gate of Fate and do Gate of Fate number four with Florentia this uh, with Subame this time. And see if I can clear this with Subame. Um like this. The question is, can you catch all the rock lobsters within two turns like this? We'll see, I suppose. Let's begin. I'll just skip this. I'm actually not sure you can. Unless you had the AoE skill on Florentia, right? But we'll see. Maybe I will after all, because all these rock lobsters will attack the extreme magic bows to Bami and kill themselves. Except for one, which attacks Florentia, but whatever. Or rather, they two of them do, but they all kill themselves. So actually, all the rock lobsters are caught in one turn. And then you now face off against Luna. Alright, 
戦場は私に任せてください。There we go. Bit of a waste of a Gate of Fate run. Because if I had gotten Tsubame on that first day, I wouldn't have had to waste the run. But at the end of the day, it is what it is. So, there we go. All of her Gate of Fates complete. And I can move on to other heroes now. Thanks for watching, everyone. I hope you found this video useful to you. And on that note, Nitro Evans.